After the Power by George Fox. And friends, though you may have tested the power and been convinced and have felt the light, yet afterwards you may feel winter storms, tempests, and hail, and be frozen and frost and cold and a wilderness and temptations. Be patient and still in the power and still in the light that doth combine you, that doth convince you to keep your minds to God and that be quiet, that you may come to the summer, that your flight be not in the winter. For if you sit still in the patience which overcomes in the power of God, there will be no flying. For, let me read that again. For if you sit in the patience which overcomes in the power of God, there will be no flying. For the husbandman, after he hath sown in his seed, he is patient. For by the power and by and by the light you will come to see through and feel over winter storms, mm, tempests, and all the coldness, barrenness, emptiness. And the same light and power will go over the tempter's head, which power and light were before he was. So in the light standing still, you see your salvation. Mm. You will see the Lord's strength. You will feel the small rain. You will feel the fresh springs and the power and light. Your mind's being kept low for that which is out of the power and light lifts up. But in the power and light, you will see God revealing his secrets, inspiring and his gifts coming unto you through which your hearts will be filled with God's love. Praise to him who lives forevermore in which light and power his blessings are received. And so, the eternal power of the Lord Jesus Christ preserve and keep you in that. And so, Live, live, live everyone in the power of God that you may all come to be heirs of that and know that to be your portion in the kingdom that hath no end and an endless life which the seed is heir of. And so feel that over all set, which hath promised and blessing of God. Thank you for listening.